Back in the leading edge, he's Rich Carr, the mayor of the city of Maumee, which, as we now know, is dumping millions of gallons of raw sewage into the Maumee River. They are not alone in that. We have understood that. They did uh, inaccurately tell the Ohio EPA they weren't discharging. There is now a new agreement. Let me let me throw a couple number numbers at you, Rich Carr. One figure flying around out there is $100 million, a rough estimate of the cost for this fix. A more troubling number to me, perhaps a number, a more troubling figure is 2051. That's the year, three decades down the road, the Ohio EPA is giving you to complete the fix? No, Jerry, that's not correct. Good, the 100 it. million was, was what we viewed as the worst possible case scenario. Okay. Uh, it, it, I do not believe it'll be anywhere near that amount. We've been working on this for a year before the EPA even told us to do anything. And immediately upon finding out while we were negotiating with the EPA, we began to take action. The, it's not going to be 30 years. I think the EPA expected to be substantially completed within 15 years. And uh, we anticipate moving ahead of that schedule. Will, will no one face any consequences for this purposeful, as it turns out, smelly mess we're dealing with? Well, the, the issue we have from Maumee's standpoint is every one of the individuals who would be responsible for having reported this are all no longer with the city of Maumee. So there's nothing we can do to them. Uh, and so that, uh, you know, what we're doing is moving forward, getting the problem corrected. Uh, it's, it's, it, it's very disgusting, Jerry. Honestly, it is. It's yeah. not something I wanted to deal with as mayor, as you can imagine. No. Now, you're in the seat. The buck stops there. Again, all of this started and was going on uh, before Rich Carr got into office. But you know, you, you, you want the big job and sometimes headaches come right along with that. I want to I want to uh, go back to something here, because you did say that 25 years ago, these storm sewers and sanitary sewers were all separated. I've also read recently there where you say, hey, some of our sewer lines in our city. I mean, there, there, there's old Maumee. Beautiful. I love beautiful, historic old Maumee. You've got some old sewer system. Do you do you need to rebuild the system as part of this? We are, Jerry. We are, we had already began budgeting five years ago to replace our sewers in the old uptown Maumee, where our city was first started. Yeah, those are over a hundred years old. Uh, we have been uh, lining them, doing everything possible. We have already commenced uh, replacing our sewer lines. This is something that has to be done all over the country, and you know I think it's been ignored. For years, not just in Maumee, but everywhere. And it, 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 so when there's federal infrastructure money coming, yeah. it's going to be used for sewers if we, we, can, we can use federal money for it. Well, uh, I just they, we they, can't they, use our tax money to fix them. That has to come from our sewer water bills, but we can use federal assistance. Meantime, and, the and, residents of Maumee have already begun paying the price in the form of sharply increased water and sewer bills. Well, Jay, if, if you look, we're still one of the lowest in the area. It went up about a dollar fourteen a day is what the increase was. We're still among the very lowest. We still have the the uh, least expensive water agreement in the area with the city of Toledo. It eventually is going to even out under the regional water agreement, but our rates, even with that increase, are, are much lower than almost everybody else. Uh, but it it did go. It went up. And, and what it comes out to, Jerry, is people spend about two cents a gallon for the water to come in and the water to go out of their home. Uh, we're going to leave it right there. He's Mayor Rich Carr, city of Maumee, um, standing up and in in facing the facts, in in talking to us about how they're going to get the fix of a of a big mess out that way. Uh, Mayor, good to see you. Best to you, and uh, we'll talk again. Thank you, Jerry. And I'll be right back on Leading Edge.